Everybody gather around. I got a little announcement to make. That means you, Wendell. You too, Euclid. All right, now listen up. I'm going to tell you about a contest. But first, I know how you feel about these bone boys. You want to kill them for messing with the cow race. <laughs> so do I. But they owe me a lot of eggs. So they're staying here to work it off. <sighs> that means I don't want any trouble from you guys. You got me? Why not, Lucius? They gotta pay for what they did. I say, tear their legs off. Yeah! They tried to make fools out of us. You made fools out of yourselves! You let this fast talking squirt trick you into betting on a cow that didn't even exist. Isn't that what happened, phony bone? Yeah, yeah, that's it. We don't need to dwell on it. <laughs> you let yourselves be talked into betting your life savings on this idiot dressed in a cow suit. Is it me or is it getting stuffy in here? But I warned you. I told you you were being played for saps, but you didn't listen to me, did you? Did you? That's right. When Grandma Ben won the race, I was the only one who bet on her. Me and Grandma could have split that pot, but no, we felt sorry for you. All bets were off and you got your livestock back. I'd say you girls got off pretty easy. <sighs> okay, now that that's settled, I want to tell you about this little contest we're going to have. These two. Kill them! Rip their heads off! Back off, or I start swinging! Here's the deal, see? As long as Phony and his cousin are working here, nobody lays a finger on them, or they answer to me. <sighs> Clear? <sighs> Clear. Alright then. Now, this contest I was telling you about. Is between me and Mr. Phony Bone here. He thinks he can run this joint better than I can. We're gonna let you decide. From now on, this bar will be divided in two. I'll run this end, and the bones will run that end. Here's the rules. You can take your business to whichever end of the bar you want. After one moon, the end that earns the most eggs for the tavern wins. You can vote for me, or you can vote for Phony. Understand the rules? <laughs> Good. Who wants a drink? What are we gonna do, Phony? Nobody's gonna order anything from us. If we lose this contest, we're gonna be washing dishes for the rest of our lives. I know, I know. This wasn't one of the smartest bets I've ever made. But we'll think of something, right? We always do. Yeah. All we gotta do is come up with some way to lure the townspeople back down to our end. How hot can it be? Right, I'm on it. Um, we'll hold a lecture series and no, 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 wait, we'll, we'll, we'll use puppets. Really cute puppets with high squeaky voices. Ah, uh, we're dead. Grandma Ben? Thorn? I mean, Princess? Don't call me that. Sorry. All those dreams. They were real. Those dreams were memories of things that really happened to me. Something like that. They were just like you said. In my dreams, I was taken out of a burning palace as a little girl. And in the dark of the night, I was brought over the mountains to the dragon's cave. I even dreamt about the ambush. I dreamt about my parents' death. And I didn't even know it. How? How can I dream about things that happened to me and not even remember any of it? Sometimes dreams know more than we do. Maybe there's more we can learn. Thorn, what happens in your dream after you get to the dragon's cave? The dragons take me on a long journey underground. 
we go to a special chamber. It's really dark at first, but then my eyes get used to the darkness. I'm aware of the shapes of the cave around me. I can see now. There's a light. I I'm in a huge cavern, surrounded by dozens of dragons, and they're all looking at something. What are you looking at? I can't, I can't see anything. The light is too bright, but the dragons want me to keep looking. They see something, but I don't. It's too bright. What else? After that, I stayed with the dragons, but I never saw that chamber again. What about the garden? Don't you want to tell Grandma about that? She heard it! She was listening to our conversation in the barn. Yes, I heard you. I can't believe it. All these years of hiding for nothing. I don't know exactly what's going on, Grandma, but you've got friends here. Won't they protect you? We're not talking about fighting off a bunch of rat creatures, Bone. This is the Lord of the Locusts, an enemy more dangerous than a legion of rat creatures. The Locust is an ancient spirit buried deep in the earth, but even so, he can still bend people to his will. Are you sure it was the dragon in your dream? I guess so, but I still don't understand. He's doing this on purpose! What? What is he doing? I don't get it! Come on, Grandma! We have a right to know! There's still something you're not telling us! Huh? Thorn? Thorn! Hey! Wait up! You feel okay? I don't feel anything. Do you want me to leave you alone? Okay, I'll go. I'm sorry. Listen, if you need anything, just tell me, alright? Everybody, come over here and try some beer! I knew puppets wouldn't work. Well, that's it. We're beaten. Nobody wants anything from us. Ready to throw in the towel, cuz? Are you crazy? That gorilla can't beat me! Especially when it comes to turning a profit. You keep trying to think of something. I'm gonna go down and look at what he's doing. I'm putting on my thinking cap. Well, well. Look what's leathered up. Ready to call it quits, smart guy? I admit, this might be a little tougher than I thought. You're welcome to hang around this end. You might learn something about running a business on the winning end of the bar. Don't get smug, it ain't over yet. Hey, what's everybody doing? Well, huh? hey, where's everybody going? What? What? What's going on? Holy crap! Looks like the tables have been turned. Ow. Excuse me while I get back to the winning end of the bar. Damn, what are you doing, Smiley? Giving this stuff away? Give me that! Give me that! Here, you give me that! Everybody, hand them over! What are you, crazy? How are we supposed to turn a profit if you give the beer away? I have had it with that runt. Me too. Lucius, or oh no Lucius, this time, let's fix them for good! Get them! Look out! I wish the lone dragon were here! What did you say? Hold it, boss. Did you just say something about a dragon? 